In today's lesson, we will dive into some powerful Linux commands that will make handling text files a breeze and boost your data analysis skills during your ethical hacking engagements. First up is the versatile cat command, which I frequently used throughout this course. The cat command can create, concatenate, and redirect files to rapidly display a file's entire content. Let's demonstrate it. To quickly read the passwd file, we use cat followed by the passwd file path. Now, let's concatenate two files with the cat command. We start with the cat keyword, then the first file name, after that, the second file name, and we redirect it to a new file. So, this comment merges the contents of file1.txt and file2.txt into a new file named combined.txt. Here's a peek at the original files. First is file1.txt. After that, file2.txt. And the combined file. Next, we'll explore the head and tail comments. These comments are a good choice for previewing a file's beginning or end. To view the first five lines of the passwd file, we use the following comment. Head, tag n5, followed by the pass to the passwd file. Without specifying the tag and option, the head comment defaults to displaying the first 10 items in the file. To view the last five lines of the passwd file, then we use the following command. Tail, tag n5, then etsy slash passwd. Piece of cake, right? Now, for large files, the more and less comments enable paginated reading. The less comment is handy, as it loads the file bit by bit rather than the complete file itself. Once the file is loaded using the less comment, use the up and down arrow keys to scroll. And once you're done, press Q to exit and return to the terminal prompt. Another handy comment is strings, which extract human readable text from binary files. Very useful for analyzing malware or unknown file types and for extracting hard-coded passwords. Let's open the natcat Windows binary file using the strings comment. To eliminate duplicate lines from a sorted file, such as password file, we use the unique command in combination with the sort command. Now to save the output of this to a file, we use the greater than symbol. And here you go. Here's the new file passwords1.txt. Lastly, the nl command adds line numbers while reading a file for easy reference. A practical tip is to combine the nl with less command for a paginated view for a large file. That's it for this lesson. Now, important to know that mastering these Linux comments is crucial for any penetration tester working with text files, analyzing data, or reverse engineering malware. Practice with passion and you'll become more efficient and effective in your ethical hacking 
Pursuits.